Can we all get along? In the last few videos, Can we, we looked at how to determine how pitcher will Can apply pitch correction along? to the incoming audio. We looked at specifying a particular scale and key, as well as manually selecting which notes and pitches to correct to. In this video, we are going to consider more advanced ways of applying pitch correction by using MIDI data to determine which note the audio is pitched to. To enable working with MIDI, we have to first enable MIDI mode, then configure the plugin to receive the required MIDI data. Clicking on the MIDI button will enable MIDI mode. In the fruity version of the plugin, once enabled, the MIDI port control will appear along the bottom of the interface, so we'll use this to link Pitcher to a MIDI out instrument channel that we will use to play Pitcher. So let's take a look at how to route MIDI within FL Studio to Pitcher using the MIDI out channel. If you do not have a MIDI out channel added to your project, you'll need to add one. Next, from the MIDI out interface, select a free MIDI port that you wish to use. For simplicity, I'm going to select a MIDI port 1, but any free port will do. Now going back to the picture interface, you simply select the same MIDI port from the port selector. That's all there is to it. The MIDI note data is being sent from MIDI out via port 1 to picture that receives it on port 1. In this way, you can set up as many pitcher plugins as you need controlled by MIDI out channels transmitting on different ports. Now if I'm to play some keys on a MIDI out interface, you can see the pitcher's note indicator show that it is receiving MIDI data and the pitch of the note being received. Now I'm going to use my MIDI keyboard and while the audio is playing, listen as I hold down a single note. Can we all get along? Can we all get along? Notice that the entire audio passage is pitch corrected to a single note, more specifically the note that I am playing. We could of course elaborate this even further by using a melodic line from the piano roll. Here I have already added my desired note data to the piano roll for the MIDI out channel. You can see that as it plays through the MIDI part, the indicated notes will show up on pitcher's interface. You can hear how the MIDI is pitch correcting the audio. Can we all get along? Can we all get along? Even when using MIDI to determine the pitch corrected notes, you can still use the speed and fine tune controls to further tweak the results. Can we all get along? And of course, we can tweak the formant as well to give the audio a fresh new character. Can we all get along? By default, Pitcher will try to match the note to the closest pitch within the same octave as the detected pitch, regardless of the octave set by the MIDI note. If I am to transpose this MIDI part up one octave, the pitch correction does not reflect this, and continues to play the notes at the same pitch and octave as before I transposed it. Can we all get along? However, if I am to enable the octaves option, then pitch correction will take into accord the octave level of the MIDI note. Can we all get along? Can we all get So, in this video, we took a look at how to use pitcher in MIDI mode, as well as routing MIDI data to the effect to control pitch correction. In the next video, we'll continue our look at MIDI, but this time to create auto harmonies for your audio. 